suspect that's going to go here. But let's look at this fine, fine lineup. Hannah Charles of St. Lucia, Kadia Rock Barbados, Tyra Charles, St. Vincent and the Grenadines, Abigail Campbell, Jamaica, Tiana Springer, Guyana, Shanky Williams, Jamaica, Narissa McPherson, Guyana, Shania Adderley of Bahamas. This is a fine lineup. This one looks like a Jamaica versus Guyana battle. <laughs> You're under 17. Well, I, I, am, I am flanked by Jamaica and mm -hmm. Guyana at the moment. So I'm keeping peace. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, yeah, you, you've got your under 17 champion from last year uh, in the person of Springer. Uh, she's an outstanding competitor. She's uh, done such great things. The South American record for under 20 already. She was the Commonwealth Youth Games champion last year. Still yet to turn 17. Abigail Campbell. On your marks. Outstanding competitor as well. Abigail Campbell won the under 17 400 title at Carifta in 2022. Has run as fast as 52 27 this season. She is the fastest in the field, but the Guyanese athletes look well poised to push her all the way. Off they go. Under 20 girls 400 final. Shanky Williams of Jamaica, like she usually does, goes out quickly. She's in lane number six. Already flying by McPherson of Guyana and going out to the Bohemian, Shania Adderley. They get up to 200 meters. Charles of St. Vincent and the Grenadines also going well. Springer of Guyana and Abigail Campbell of Jamaica with some work to do. Shank you, Williams has gone really quickly here for the first 300. Springer and Campbell start to move as they enter the straightaway. Charles is in second position for St. Vincent and the Grenadines. Shank you, Williams leads. Here comes Tiana Springer. The Guyanese has the advantage. It's going to be Tiana Springer. The under 17 champion from last year becomes the under 20 champion this year. We can't wait until we see this time because where it stopped on the screen and in the field is confusing me. This is a terrific performance. Told you in qualifying, she is no ordinary athlete. Mm -hmm. And she produces a sensational performance. I think especially the champion in on the 17 division in 2022 abigail campbell will be disappointed with her own tactics but no issues from this young lady 52 31 it's a lifetime best for her she is corrupt on the 20 champion coach mark scott will be pleased with the police club chase academy over in guyana will be absolutely pleased and i'm sure our guest here this evening alien oh. pompey all Will the be. Guyanese are proud. I, my heart was in my microphone, essentially, but the level of composure that she showed. I mean, the Jamaican athlete, Miss Williams, went out so hard. Um, I don't know. It takes a level of composure. I'm not sure I ever had to kind of keep um, your mental focus and stick to your race plan all the way through. But after that, with 120 to go, she made a decisive move and just kept going, kept going. And... It was beautiful to watch, beautiful to watch. Just 17 years old, has a couple more years left in this division, going from not something we see very often, especially in the sprints, going from being the under 17 champion to now under 20 champion in the space of one year. Well, Adidas has already realized her talent. They've signed a nil deal with her at just 16 years old and uh, changing the game nil and tiana springer strikes gold in the under 20 division at the carifta games in a personal best 52.31 abigail campbell 52.85 down on her personal and season's best shank williams of jamaica with the bronze 53.03 that's a personal best for her as well what a race what a final what a performance from tiana springer of guyana as we rush the Gerard Morisili, who has a Jamaican record holder. 